So I see this THFTP video, got everybody in their feelings. I'm getting DMs and I ran across Mr. Campbell's video. And once again, we running from the truth, not acknowledging the real, man. Y'all make sure y'all hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. So I guess Mr. Campbell rambling about how back in his era, dudes would have gave THFTP a pass because he was with his kids. Listen, man, we not in that era no more, man. We ain't been there. This is not new. Why do we run from, let me, let me tell y'all the real. You know who put them kids in harm's danger? It wasn't the shooters, man. It was THFTP itself, bro. Now you got this vibrant ass diss song that been out for years. Taunting the dead. On top, if y'all living under a rock, THFTP is being accused of killing somebody. And the person he being accused of killing, they celebrate uh, his friends celebrating the death. And they making a lot of self-incriminating posts, but I ain't going to get into all that. But basically, if you know you are a target and you know you are being accused of committing murder and you be with dudes who have been locked up for murder, free accused of murder, and you got this song, what the hell is you doing? Walking down the street with your goddamn baby mama and kids, like everything just sweet, man. And one thing I'm gonna say is, listen, was it immorally fucked up, if, if immorally is the word, that them, that them kids had to see their father get killed? Yes, it was. But I got to give a hand to the shooters, though, because they didn't shoot the girl or the two little babies. They could have easily shot them. Easily. The two little girls was right there, man. They could have not cared about nothing, pulled up, and just got to shoot. But you know what they did? They got out the car and walked them down. So in a way, those shooters had no respect for the children, but they spared them children, man. They did. And I don't hear nobody talking about that. There's no rules to the streets, and we been knew that. <laughs> That's why I don't understand. TP knew these rules. I'm not going nowhere with my kids, bruh. We ain't placing the right blame, and we thinking about the wrong shit. Those shooters are at fault for doing what they did in front of them kids. But who's at most fault, TP, for even putting them kids in that situation, man? Come on, man. This is a wake-up call. And I'm glad the video came out only to show that it ain't sweet out here, bro. You can move correctly. And, and, and them dudes, I can tell that them dudes coming from the streets and being a part of the old, older generation before this one and this one. TP was hard to find and hard to catch. They had to do him right there. You feel what I'm saying? But TP put them children and that woman's life in risk. And nobody really talking about that. So for all you dudes out here that's game banging, all you dudes out here who did something, all you dudes out here who affiliated to, to murder, death, and all that, wake up call. Don't be walking around with your kids. Don't be walking around with your baby mama. Don't be walking around, period. You feel what I'm saying? So yeah, it's fuck them shooters for scarring them kids for life. Fuck them niggas, you feel me? But at the same time, I'm not running from the truth. I'm not running from reality. And I understand what's going on. So on one hand it's fuck them. But on the other hand it's thank you for not killing them goddamn kids like y'all easily could have. And y'all could have been the demons that y'all claimed. And y'all could have been them gremlins and the devil and all that shit. And y'all could have just did away with everybody. That easy. 
We run from the problems, and that's why we don't have solutions. We still in denial, and we still on old shit. Listen here, shit like this been going on now for a while, years now, years. I'm not surprised. I'm actually numb to it, and that's why we have to do better at protecting our own our own kids from seeing shit like that. Period. Everybody is to blame here. The baby mama, you know what type of nigga you walking with. TP, you know what you done did, who you affiliated with, and you a big ass target. And them shooters, all of them receive blame. But why are we not telling the truth about the situation, man? We can't keep relying on other people to spare our kids. We can't keep relying on other people to trust our kids, man. We got to do that ourselves. And I pray for them little girls because they witness something that's going to scar them forever. You feel what I'm saying? This is going on everywhere, man. But it's just something inside me that just thank God that them niggas did what they did, how they did it. Because what they was going to do, they was going to do. We can't change that. No, I'm not saying I'm glad that they killed TP. But what I'm saying is, if they was going to kill TP with kids around, I'm glad it happened just like that. Because I'd rather deal with my children being scarred than burying them. I'd rather deal with my children being scarred and I get killed then they don't even have a future, a life, or nothing. Because let me tell you something, man. It's a lot of people out here who witness murders of their parents and witness murders of their friends at a young, young age. Some don't deal with it well, some do. Hey, at least they got a chance. At least they got a chance. But for what I'm used to, and I'm going to be honest, them kids would have been dead, bro. The shooters went again, no fuck. They would have never hopped out. They just would have pulled up and got the shooting. And we all know what that means, man. This is a very sad situation, but it's not surprising. Hell, we don't know what THF uh, TP did. We don't know what the circumstances was behind it, man. All I know is it ain't never been no killing without killing. And if you high target enough, they don't give a damn if the police there. They don't give a damn if the Gold Coast there. They don't give a damn if kids there. It been like this for years. So us complaining about what it used to be ain't helping now. Stop complaining about how shit used to be. It ain't that no more. It ain't being that no more. Can we please accept the problems uh, accept self accountability and not make the same mistake TP made so we can protect our goddamn kids instead of relying on niggas who finna come take our life to protect them more than what we did. Because at the end of the day, TP put his kids in danger. They made sure that they got their target. Ain't that what we cry for all the time? First of all, you know what? I'm going to say some of this for the live stream. Y'all just make sure y'all hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and share this video. Let me know y'all thoughts, man. King AK47 for Street. I'm out.